Hey, what's up YouTube? So today I'll be doing an informal tutorial. I'm still trying to figure out how to put all these tutorials together, but this one was by request. It's my front style brain twister combo, and this is how it looks. This is a brain twister combo that I used to do back in the early 2000s when I was competing. And it has been my go-to brain twister combo. I usually mix it up with some split bottom mounts and some boingy boingy. So I'll first show the brain twister combo first with what elements I use. And it's very easy. It's only, um, it's only like two different elements to a usual brain twister. I'll show you different variations to show you the different varieties that I mix things up with. Okay, so I'll change the camera angle and it'll give you a better look at what the trick looks like. Okay, and here we go. Here's what the trick looks like without slowing down. The yo-yo I'm using is the Voson Exia. Review will be coming up pretty soon. So you'll start this trick like how you'll start the brain twister with an undermount. So this version of the undermount is the simple version of doing the brain twister. You could do it in various different mounts. I'll show the other one. So you'll begin your trick with doing a few brain twisters. And then what you'll do is you'll take your index finger from your throw hand and instead of doing another cycle of the brain twister, you're going to put that index finger to stop that motion so that the brain twister will actually land on the multiple strings that are coming off from your other finger, like so. So your yo-yo is actually landing on around three to four strings here. And then once you land it, you pop it off back towards you and then you're going to do a kind of a reverse brain twister. And then what you're going to do is you're going to take the index finger from your non-throwing hand and you're going to intercept that brain twister and land on that one string that's coming from your throw hand. And then you'll dismount. You can either end it with a skin to gerbil, you can do it with a bind, or you can continue with any other trick that can follow with it. And here it is with the brain twister undermount. So the beginning of this is actually just slightly different than the previous one. You'll do a few brain twisters. Intercept with your throwing hand index finger. You'll land on a bunch of string. Pop it off. Do a few reverse brain twisters. And then with your non-throwing hand, you're going to intercept that motion so that it'll land on that one string that's coming from your throw hand. Dismount. And then bind. So you might see me doing this brain twister combo along with my front style combo which is usually a atomic bomb or split the atom with atomic boingy boingy and then I can release a couple of strings to do this brain twister combo and you might also notice that in some of my videos I probably don't put it in there but whenever I miss a boingy boingy or if I miss landing on this string I use my brain twister speed combo as kind of a recovery as if I didn't mess up right there. And then you'll see. So it's kind of a way to hide any type of mistakes that I do. So I originally did this combo back in the responsive yo-yo days. So that was in the early 2000s. There was not really any unresponsive yo-yos out at that time. So I'm doing this combo with one of my favorite responsive yo-yos in the days, the Duncan Freehand one. And this is the same trick essentially on a responsive yo-yo. So this is what I so this is the yo-yo that I use to do this combo on. And as you notice, I also use my brain twister combo as a kind of an escape route as well if I don't blend my tricks properly. So I hope you liked that tutorial. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And let me know how this first informal tutorial is like. I'm trying to put together some tutorials for beginners and eventually into intermediate and advanced tricks. And I don't know about all the tricks that are the current things like slacks, since I'm not very good with slacks or hooks 
or rejections, but leave a comment and tell me what you think. See you in the next video.